Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be out here on the Hunter Call of the Wild. We're out here on the New England mountains and we're going to be hunting an albino eastern wild turkey. So this is pretty cool. It's my first ever rare turkey. I was actually looking for moose zones last night because I was going to do the moose guide here for the New England mountains today when I spotted him just walking along the side of this lake. And I wasn't too sure exactly what he was, I thought he might have been leucistic, but then I picked up the track he was albino. So we're going to try to track him down here, I'd already reset the game and everything like that, so I'm not too sure exactly where he's going to be going. we got quite a few different sets of tracks here, I would assume he's probably heading down the mountain, but I don't know, we're going to go ahead and look at these, like he is going all over the place here, so it might take some time to actually try and find him. So that's a very old one, the other one was old, so I don't know. These tracks are going back up the mountain, so it's probably going to take some time here, like I said, but I'm going to try and find him. I will let you guys know when I do, and then after that, once we take him down, we'll hunt like four or five more animals just so I can give you a little bit something extra for this video, and then we'll head to the lodge and find a place to put him, if we do indeed get him down. So, I guess I'll let you know when I find him. So just a slight change of plans here, instead of me just running around everywhere not really knowing where he's going to be at, I decided to go ahead and reset the time and also reset the game to try and recreate what happened last night. So I was looking for moose zones, like I said, over here, when he walked right along the edge of the lake here, and then I was like right there, so I ended up spooking him pretty quickly. But if he does take that same path, we should be able to see him. It was like 1440 when I saw him, it's already 1429 right now. So he should be coming through pretty soon if he does take that same path that he did last night. So that's what we're going to try to do is just recreate what happened. And yeah, I'll let you know if I see him and if I don't, we will just kind of run around until we potentially find him. I don't know where his zone is or anything like that. And there he is, guys. Level 2, 4 for his estimate, 7 to 9 kg. He did the exact same thing he did last night. I was hoping he would do that. He came around the edge here, just out of the bushes, and now he's coming along this side. So we're going to go ahead and try and get him. I think I'm just going to use the 22. we We're not going to try anything crazy with like the shotgun or anything. We're just going to get the 22 out and go ahead and snipe him. But he looks absolutely incredible right there. I'm actually going to get a screenshot of just that. Um, just because he looks so good. Let's go ahead and take that shot right there. It'll be fantastic. We have a little golden eye right here. I think I'm going to go ahead and take him down too. Never mind. I missed that shot. So we won't worry about it. We do have some moose over here. That's a level 3, 134 to 188. But we got the thing we were looking for, albino turkey. Like I said, this is my first ever um, rare turkey, so it's very, very exciting. So let's get over here, let's get him, and we'll get some screenshots and everything, and tax him, and get him ready for the lodge. He looks absolutely incredible, so let's go ahead and just pick him up here and get him taxed and everything. He will be a gold at 4.22, and we got him in the flesh. Actually, just got him right there in the leg. But it doesn't matter with the turkeys, as long as you get one shot on them, they're going to go down very quickly. So let's go ahead and tax him. He is an albino and just looks absolutely stunning. This is super incredible. Really glad I was able to find this guy last night. Like I said, he just kind of came out of nowhere, like he did just a little bit ago. And then, yeah, I just decided to go ahead and make a video on him. So 130 um, meters for the distance, and he's just a nice level 2 albino turkey. So let's go ahead and accept him and everything. Like I said, now we're going to go ahead and hunt just some other animals, maybe 4 or 5, just to kind of add something to this video so it's not like 3 minutes long. And then we'll head to the lodge and find a place to put him. We've got a level 6 gray fox up ahead. Right now I'm just trying to find him, and that's actually going to be him right there. 5 to 6 for his estimates. Let's take that shot, and I think, yeah, he, we got him right there. He went down immediately. So I was trying to get him while he was in his zone, but the wind was just absolutely terrible on um, where he was at, and he just ended up spooking. So it was very unfortunate, but I ended up chasing him down here. Hopefully we got a good shot. I think it might have been a little bit far back, and is that vital blood? It is not vital blood. So we got him down, but it was probably like spinal cord or maybe into the stomach or intestines. Okay, yeah, it was the thoracic spinal cord and the thoracic vertebrae, so just a little bit high on that shot, unfortunately. But he is a silver 5.34. He would have been just above gold. 5.32 is gold. 0.2 above gold. So that is unfortunate that we messed him up there. Um, but yeah, just it was a shot I had to take, honestly. So let's go ahead. We'll just accept him. And now we have a level 3 moose. 119 to 173. So obviously he's not the biggest one ever. We are going to go ahead and take him down. Like I said, I was looking for moose zones when I ended up finding that albino turkey. So I'm probably going to do the moose guide, I would say, tomorrow. Um, Tuesday, we'll have the EW live stream. So yeah, probably on Monday, I will do the moose guide here for New England Mountains. So let's wait for him to raise his head back up, and then we'll go. he's going to keep going down. Wait for him to raise it up one more time here. And then we'll take something like that with the 7mm. Should be good. I tried to potentially go for the heart shot, but it did not work out, as you can see. But he's going to be dropping the 7mm. Just takes him a little bit longer. He's already at 50-75, so let's get over here and let's get him. There's actually another one right there that is a female. And let's see, do we see any others? No, it's probably a little bit too far out over there. Plus, it's at the end of their drink time, so they should be leaving anyway, so let's go get him. 
Here's our level 3 Moose, let's go ahead and pick him up, and he's going to be a silver at 153.36, got him in the right lung, so it was a fantastic shot right there where we aimed, and honestly, had we had just a little bit more penetration, we would have gotten into the heart, it just did not have enough there, as you can see, we were a few inches away from it. But 126 meters for the distance there, he's just a decent little level 3, nothing crazy about him, gold is 194, so he's a long ways from that. Now we have some white tail deer. There's a level 2, 146 to 187. Let's go ahead and try and get him right now. I think we should be able to get a nice little shot on him. And we did. That was perfect. There's actually another male just up ahead of them. I think he was a level 1, or level 2, 129 to 170, but he's still pretty small. But that was fantastic on that one. Did not expect that to go as well as it did. Let's see, what else do we have over here? Right now I don't have my headphones on, so if there is like animals calling out, I do not know what they are. But I did see an indicator over here. But yeah, it doesn't really matter too much right now. Let's get over here and let's get our whitetail as we fall down the mountain. There's the vital blood and here's our whitetail deer picking him up. He's going to be a silver 180.13. We got him in the intestines, the stomach, and the liver. So it was a far back shot. Honestly, kind of expected that and I just expected it to be a bad shot in general. But getting into the liver, that is what really got him down because the liver is a vital shot. So obviously not the best shot to take, but it got into a vital organ. So that is pretty good. But 180.13 gold is 193.79, so he was a little ways from being a gold, but he's a decent silver. So I think that is going to do it here. We're going to go ahead and head down to the lodge and find a place to put our albino um, eastern wild turkey. Now we're here in the lodge, and I really don't have a place to put this turkey. We can't put them on the small plaques, unfortunately. I really wish that glitch was still around where you could like put bigger animals on smaller plaques. I just wish it was a thing still. I think most people do as well. But I think I'm going to take down my albino bighorn sheep here. We'll just take him down. I can put him somewhere else. He's not a super big one anyway. Still a cool trophy, but I think I do want to put my eastern wild turkey here. So there he is, albino turkey. Let's go ahead and put him down 4.23 for his trophy rating. So that is indeed pretty cool. Like I said, just really excited that we got one of these. It's my first ever rare turkey. So let's go ahead and position him. I think I'll just do something like that. Just something basic um, with him all fluffed out like that. But that's pretty much going to do it here for this video. Just a nice, um, short and sweet one today. Taking down an albino turkey and then hunting a few other animals after that. So I really do hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, remember to like, subscribe, comment, do all that stuff. Really does help out the channel. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.